Good morning, everyone. So, um, just finished a workout with my daughter while we were working on a little self defense. And now the punches don't have to be hard, but throw them fast. Here we go. One, two, three. Move out. Elbows in. Here we go. Put it all together. One, two, three. Oh, nice. During the course of that, she kind of scraped her finger and was really getting distracted by that notion. Um, and so, my point of today is sometimes things happen to us that are out of our control but what we can control is what we do about it. And that's where we often have to focus and rise above whatever it is that has um, taken our, our attention for a moment and then get back on task. And so some of the examples that I use with her is that if you, you know, heaven forbid, actually have to, you know, defend yourself in that capacity. You are fortunate to have experienced something like a finger scrape now, so that way it doesn't distract you in the real moment. Um, another example I used was um, going to school and having a small tear in your dress when you have a, uh, a test to take or something like that. You don't let those sort of things distract you from what you've worked hard to accomplish and a small thing like that is still something that you have no control over it could have been a poorly made dress it could have been something that was um, snagged on something that you were unaware of there's a variety of reasons why that would happen but what you do about it is really the it, that's the real um, that's the real part of the test um, broken pencil it happens so you're prepared with another pencil or you calmly get up and you go and sharpen your pencil and proceed on your testing so there's a lot of things that we can look at as an immediate reason as to why we cannot continue but really what it's saying is we weren't prepared or we weren't mentally prepared to follow through on this uh, on this journey that we'd set out for and that's okay as well fail acronym first attempt in learning but what it says is we should actually be able to rise above focus through and focus finding our calm under stress or finding our concentration under stress whatever you like um, and from there being able to say okay it happened it's over now let me move on uh, we see it in a lot of areas in life My, mainly it's I think it's um, supported through sports and we you know cheer people who've been injured and then return but we see this every day we see this every day with people who like you like me who go to work when we're not feeling well uh, who still make it to work if you have car troubles um, still make it to work if you have personal problems uh, are experiencing professional problems in the job and you still go in so there's a variety of places where this is already exhibited so celebrate you know the hero in you and um, and those around you so I'm gonna leave it at that if you like the content please again feel free to leave um, your advice a comment experience have an ace up your sleeve and click in the subscribe the like notification buttons are all free and very appreciated so I hope this finds everybody in a good place of health mind body and soul and uh, we'll talk to you soon peace love unity solidarity